folks. Today we're back out of the shop. Mike's down here with us. Getting cold, late November. That uh, old ratty over there. I had to move it off the lift to uh, get some winterizing done on my wife's car. And I got that tucked away for the winter. Got some work we're going to do on that coming up here soon. Today we're just putting on the winter tires and a quick oil change. Mikey's doing it because I'm lazy. What's Mikey doing? Fortnite. What the heck's Fortnite? Oh, that's that video game. You didn't have it in the right spot, did ya? It was. It was slightly off. Oh, right? slightly off. It was not on. It was on yeah. it, but the other side was also on it. Uh-huh. Okay. Just the button. Let's go. Get it up. Okay. Now, that handle. No, not this one. Those are your safety locks. You never take that off unless you want to lower the car. Press that until it sits on the locks. Now you're safe. It's raining in November. Well, at least it ain't snow. Get him up! How do I change that down? Why is it so hot? That's how it's supposed to be. Still not NASCAR speed, bud. Gotta work on that. Oh. Oh. What? You don't need that off. It won't come off. Really? Come on, get it up there. Oh, the rain's picking up. I hope it doesn't turn to freezing rain. I like freezing rain. You're crazy. Come on, man. Hurry up. Just grab the outside of the tire. Like that? No, on the left and the right. Why do you... Why do you... Why do you... Do I need to show you how to pick up a car tire? I don't know how to put it on when it's at a height like that. If you have holes, you can do this. If you don't, and you don't want your fingers, you just grab it like that. Now it's at the right height where you can see the holes. Easy peasy. You ain't going to get invited to anybody's pit crew if you can't tell your tire faster than that. Ah, that's cr not crossways. Ah. It's like locking up. I don't know, man. It needs work. Go ahead, show us, show us how fast you can get a wheel off. Let's go. Okay, get it off there. Let's see. Ah, I ah, fail already. Come on, NASCAR boss. It ain't off yet. Apparently didn't clean our snow tires when we took them off last year, so we got some mud to get out before we can balance that one. Go ahead, put that on there. You know how to put it on? You got one of them at school, do you? Yeah. You're not even close to on there straight. Come here, come here look at that. Watch. Look, look. I can't see it. Now it says tighten it up. What's it say? I thought it was locked on correctly. 7.5. 7.5. There you go. What's the other two things you need? Oh, you're measuring the offset. That's 5? 5.5 is what it looks like. That's actually 7. There you go. Now what's the last thing you got to do? Really? I just literally showed you. It's the rim. How big is the rim? It, 16. You could measure it or just look at the tire. 16. It's a 17. All right, close the lid. Beep boop. Whee! Six in. Better not suck your hand in. Oh, a 
half ounce on the inside and a quarter ounce on the outside. Psyching yourself out, are you? Don't hold your breath, you'll pass out. See, I actually, I actually like it a little higher. <laughs> Gotta love that pretend chrome that they put on. Let me see. It's just stuck on to plastic. They call that chrome. Ooh, remember, lock the knees and lift with the back in a sharp jerking and twisting motion. <laughs> Did you forget something? <laughs> I can help, but where's the fun in that? You done yet? No. Come on, go faster. I don't want to. Are you missing something there, Spanx? No. You, uh, no. no. Maybe you want to move that over so no. that it doesn't drain down your shirt and into your underwear? No, I think that would be fine. Uh huh. A little warm oil. So we got these new uh, Flexi funnels, these cheapy things off of Amazon. On it. I'll show you why these things are kind of handy. You see here where the drain bolt is back here and Initially, it'll clear the skid pan, but eventually it's just going to drip and pool up in here. And taking that thing off is a pain just to do this job. So these little, you know, these little flexi funnels are good. You can bend them in all kinds of different shapes. Jam it right in there like that. Make yourself a nice little V. Let's, uh, let's test this area out. I'll stand back over here. Ah, thanks, man. It's easy not defusing a, a nuclear bomb there. Let's go. There it is. Told you it had to be closer. That's not bad. Look, you barely got any on your fingers, and it's working. Except you got it all over my gloves. Oh, yeah. Got it on my gloves. Look at the mess you made. <laughs> hey, you turned your back on it. That's gonna, it's gonna start messing. Look, it's gonna mess. It's gonna mess, Mike. Dad, you do it. I can't. I'm unable or unwilling. We gotta get a real thing. Look at that! Look at the mess he made! Missed the darn drain pan! Even with the flexi funnel. Worst Saturday ever. It's Friday. It's Friday. It's Friday? Yes, it's Friday. If it's Friday, why are you home? Because it's a PA day. Oh. It's a PA day, guys. It's Friday. What's wrong with you thinking it's Saturday? Get a life, man. Yeah, you lubricated up the tools. Just spin that in there a little bit, get a little more oil. Oh, now it's, oh, well, that's, that's lubricated for you. Now, now. Taste no. it. It's no, like, it's no. Like chocolate, rich European chocolate. Watch, watch it. Well, the Flexi funnel worked pretty good, other than Mikey uh, not setting up the thing properly. I really need to get a proper oil uh, drain now for the lift. Say it again. I don't want it. He just asked me, how do you pop the hood? 17 years old. Well, there's the trunk. Where's the hood button? If you open up and look down, you'll see it. <gasps> he figured it out. Because it what says, because it says hood. Now you're in for it. Your mom's coming to check on the progress of her automobile. Hurry up. <laughs> Inspector General's in the house. It's okay, you can come in. Oh, my hair's not done. My hair's not done either. Mike, is your hair done? Is your hair done? What kind of oil does it take, Mike? Um, well, it's not dirt bike oil. What was that thing in your hand you just took off? What? The cap. The yellow cap. Look at the cap. What does it say? S A E O. No, not O. Zero W twenty. There you go. That's the kind of oil it takes. Zero W20. Ooh, Castrol Zero W. Made in Kanakia. No stick thing. I got to use my arm today. Come on, let's go get some oil. Where's the funnel? You got to put it in without a funnel? Yeah. Be all over the place. Mikey found a funnel all on his own. It's a miracle. Look at you even cleaning the funnel out. Look, other rat rods in pieces 32 Chevy pickup 
Oh my god, stop! Huh. Nothing. Keep going. <laughs> I wanted to see how fast you would stop. Usually you just look at me, it's funny. You don't even got to do math, it does the math for you. Look, two liters left. That's only three, you only put like three liters in there. So I need more than that. The old jug, a minus 40 windshield washer fluid. Gotta switch to that. Last thing you want is frozen up washer fluid squirter thingies. So is Mikey going to be a Corvette guy or a Jeep guy? Probably a Jeep guy. Probably a Jeep guy, eh? But where are we at with Jeep? Where are we at? Yeah. Well, running safe and driving right now. That's ready to go. We're ready to go for a year. You just ain't got your license. All right, so we get into our little menu hoo uh, here. And we got to do our, uh, uh, let's see, lighting doors. Maintenance reset. That's the first one we got to do. And that resets the oil to 100%. And then we go to TPMS calibration, tire pressure monitoring system. Calibrate. And that just standardizes the current tire pressures because there's wireless Bluetooth sensors in each tire that monitor the low tire. So there you go. Okay, so there's a quick video uh, how to winterize your car up here in Canada, I guess. Uh, I know it's pretty boring stuff, but more than anything, I wanted to get one message across to everybody. Teach a kid to work on a car. That way, when you're old and he says, hey, my car's broke, can you fix it? You can just say, no, I taught you how to do it. Fix it your damn self.